To hear spoilers tease that it's truly been one of those heartbreaking years for the events of loss that the people on the show themselves are having. After the deaths of the show's legendary actors, now the new death is being confirmed and now it's another veteran employee, Craig Oliver Zojin, whose death is being confirmed when a terrible accident took away the program's veteran staff. In fact, Craig Oliver, himself and the show most veteran employee, having contributed 39 years to the backstage operations of General Hospital and other ABC and Disney shows. But it seems that when our male employee is just retired and is planning to go on a trip, a disaster is being confirmed. The fact that one of the new incidents is increasingly causing one of the new outbreaks is being confirmed even more quickly. If the same terrible bicycle accident that took place on the 15th of May 10 years ago, and that's causing Craig to be in critical condition. But despite the careful care that doctors are scheduling new disasters, are one of the new dangers that are being recognized more publicly. But it seems that one of the more serious incidents took our male employee on October 26th. It's indeed a shock that Craig Oliver himself has just announced that he will retire in within at least three months. This is creating a huge hole in the preparations of General Hospital's other employees. Of course, even when the painful announcements are appearing, this is proving that the concerns of colleagues and even the actors of the show are quickly sharing their sorrows as quickly as possible. But it seems that one of the crazy new events is being confirmed more and more quickly. If it is his family is taking on one of the new dangers that are coming and it's proving it's said that one of the new horrors is being confirmed even more recently. Craig Oliver is surely a man of great enthusiasm and his death is making one of the new shocks that are causing new tensions to be increasingly confirmed. Back on GH, we're seeing that Gladys is trying to send Sasha to Ferncliff, but it seems uniquely that these incidents will get any simpler if the control that Sasha has over her condition is increasingly asserted. But if one of the crises Gladys herself is causing causes a new incident of deception to occur, but it seems that one of the new crises is causing one of the events that the PCPD is having is causing one of the troublesome events that Gladys is accepting to be one of the dangers. New dangers are emerging, but it seems that one of the fairness that Gladys is getting is increasingly one of the new madness that's causing Gladys herself is accepting to send Sasha back to Ferncliff and is proving that Sasha is being exposed to an explosion in the new tensions that are being acquired.